this video tutorial it's a presentation on how to use the Windows Explorer in a way that you can manage your files and folder in your computer. So when you start your computer you should arrive on, the, on your desktop, it should be empty with some icons uh, on the left or maybe a little bit everywhere. So how do we start the Windows Explorer? Explorer if we want to manage our files. So the simplest way you should have an icon on the left bottom corner um, of your screen, this yellow folder, and we can just do a simple left click, single left click. And then it start a window for us. So your window might look a little bit different, but normally you should have at the top a bar here telling you where you are. At some moment we are in the library. And also you got a left bar showing you everything you have on your computer. And then there is a middle view that is showing you the content of what is selected. So because we are in library now, this is everything that is in library. If I'm clicking on desktop, left click, I will see everything that's on the desktop. Also all these icons there, they are the same that are here. So this is a view of what is selected. Your view here can be different, there will be some bigger icons or smaller icons. And it's very important to know that we can change this view. So this little icon here, little down arrow, black one, will allow us to change the view. So if I, I can change the view here from really big icon to very small icons and just a list. So if I want to see the big icons, I can change this like that. I can change all the way to small icons, even all the way to details. So let's say extra large icon, they are really, really big. All the way down to the small icon, or the list, or the detail. The one we use a lot is the details one, because we can have a lot of information about what it is, what's the size of the file or folder, and the date when it was created or modified. So this is a Windows Explorer here. I can make this window smaller or bigger. So I just, first of all, I can move it around. So if I just do a, a drag and drop, so I'm gonna, on this blue bar here, I'm gonna do a left click and I'm gonna keep my left click down and I'm gonna move the mouse. So if now I'm gonna do a left click and I keep it down, I can move the mouse and the window is moving around. So you can put it in the right place for you to be comfortable, so let's say in this corner here. I can also change the size of it. So I can go right on the edge of the window here when the, go, the, the icon is going from a single arrow to two arrows. And same thing, I'm gonna do a left click and I'm gonna keep the left click down and I can move left or right to make the windows bigger. Same thing at the bottom here, left click maintain the left click down and I can move like that and same thing in the corner here I can make the windows bigger so I can move it around and make it the right size for me so as we can see if I change the left pane here and I can click download I will see here everything that is download here on the desktop Every time I want to go and see inside one of the folder, let's say photos, I can do a double click on photos and it, it will take me inside photos. So at some moment we're on desktop. If I do a double left click on photos, then I can see the photos here. So now we are on photos and I can see the list of all my pictures when they were taken and the date. If I want to see these pictures, I can change the view here like we've done before to extra large icon. And that's going to give me an idea of this picture. And I can see them if I'm looking for something, a bit of mangrove. And I can do a double click, double left click on the picture if I want to see it. And then you can see the picture. I can close the window. If I want to, for the Windows Explorer, if I want to minimize uh, the window, I don't want to see it again, but I don't want to close it, I'm going to use this button here, minimize. I can do just a single left click. And the window is gone. It's in, a, it's in my bar here. And I can do another left click to bring it back. If I want to put it in full screen, then I'm going to go to maximize this button here. I'm going to do a single left click and I'm using all the screen. So it's pretty good one I want to see. I want to go back to the other size. I'm going to click here to restore down left click and I'm back to normal.
If I want to close this window completely, I just use this white cross with a red background, do a single left click, and now it's closed. If I want to get them back, I can just do another left click here. Another way to start Windows Explorer is also to go to do a left click on start, and I can do a left click, single left click on computer. And then having this window here, and we start it on computer. And then we can have a look at all the things there. So every time you want to travel and have a look at um, inside your folders, you can just do double click on uh, different folders. I want to go inside another double click, and now I've got a photo there. If I want to go back to where I was before, I can just use this arrow here, and I'm taking me back to where I was before. I can move this photo here. Sometimes you need to have multiple Windows Explorer windows open, which is quite useful if you want to copy different file or folder from one place to another. So we can simply go to the start, do a left click, less single left click on the start button, and another single left click on the computer, and it will start another Windows for us. So we can have on this one desktop uh, maps, double click on maps, and I got my maps, and on this one I can probably have, if I want to, um, desktop photos. So two different things. I can also, if I want to, create another one. To do this, I can also, if I want, uh, use the uh, shortcut uh, Control N for new, new window, but I have to have one of them selected. So I can use my uh, shortcut on the keyboard Control N and it's creating another new window for me. And I can do that again, Control N. I can have as many windows as I, as I want. So I'm going to close these two. And of course you can move them around, change the view for each of them. So this one I'm happy with uh, details and maybe this one I want the uh, large icon, and so on. 